Hello everybody, this is Jim McCool again, back with another Naughty and Culture video. I started these videos like up like last time for people looking for armor and full weaponry for Naughty and Plays and Cosplay. Now, I'm going to do a two-parter for this culture because some of them are hard and they're a little bit more expensive than the Dwarven Infection can, but not too bad. So, I'm going to do this video on armor for the fun faction, then sometime in the near future I'll do a video for the fun weaponry. All right, so I'm just going to start with the simplest piece from Epic Armory. They're ready for battle, go again, armor. So actually I'm going to put this one on. Okay. So as you can see, this will be mainly used for like light infantry and all that. If you don't want to pay a lot of money for your fawns for even any factions this would be easiest for the fawn culture this was about I'm guessing 25 bucks for the medium size about 30 35 for the larger size but this is pretty good for the, for the price it feels comfortable I can move around in it very easily I could swing a weapon and also this would provide, provide good protection just in case now this is like a discontinued series so if you want to get one go you better go quickly and grab it I bought this one off of Empire Armory and I'm gonna don donate it to the theater I work with because they need a lot of use a lot of armor and stuff for the Narnia productions and all that going off to my next one which is a full leather piece the ready for battle fighter armor sorry for the lighting let's go let's try this okay there's a brown leather armor basically it's meant to look like the arm armor where the early medieval periods where they put plates inside of it this one does not have plates inside of it but this is actually a second quality one which you can go buy for like 45 bucks of the website which is the reasonable very reasonable actually i love this armor i already tried it on a couple of times and it's amazing if you don't want to get the second quality kind you can get the regular kind but it will cost you like 60 for small medium and then 70 for the large and next to large sizes so as again it comes in it comes apart easily, easy to put on quickly and then efficiently. For quick changes or from like civilian to warrior fonts or vice versa. Okay, so next one I'm going to, the final one, is the, actually the one I got from Epic Armory in the scavenger box. So now, I don't, I don't know if Epic Army, Epic Army, if this is like a prototype thing or something, but this is very, very well put together. And I do thank you for sending me this. So this would be cool for like fawns, cultures, if you want to use it for something else like centaurs or even the minotaurs for the white witches side if you're doing land of witches or job. Just here's another thing. I have no idea how much this would cost. Because I cannot find this on the website yet, so if this is like a sneak peek to something, this will be very cool. It also came with these pieces, which I'm not sure what they are 100%. I don't know the tacit so it's something I can't find anything to hook them to. So Epic Army, if you can email me to figure that out if you don't mind. But, yep. Alright, that's all I have for it. Armor for the fun factions, you might be thinking, Jimmy Wade, there's no helmets or anything like that. Well, the reason why there's no helmets is because fawns have horns. And unfortunately, it's, you can use this video for the same for the sailors too, because they, because the armor and basically CS Lewis describe them as being the same, only a different shade of color. But that's all I have for the armor. The weapons will be coming up. Also for epic armory stuff. 
you might want to try these uh, braces. The leather braces, you can get them pretty decent. You can get the ready for battle ones, pretty decent price. Good, looks like good quality leather and all that. Alright, that will be it for this section. Except for one thing, the banquet that Logos Theater is holding, the Into the Wardrobe, is happening on April 29th, I still believe. Yeah, so if you want to find more out uh, more about that, click up here. To learn more, more about the comic, click down here. To subscribe to my channel, click up here. Thank you, and have a good night.